At around 9 a.m., we hit the road to Maki in the Nachinyuguzi zone, where 43-year-old Robert Segawa lives. <laughs> On arrival at his home, we found him with over 400 laptop casings from different brands and sizes, alleged to have been removed from stolen laptops. Segawa claims he has been keeping them as crap. Actually, these people have been vandalizing cars and houses, targeting these computers, whether they are deployed by these people who have been arrested or they would simply buy from them. From Maki, detectives went to Kiseka where Segawa has a workshop. He pulled out over 100 laptop screens, functioning laptops, and those that he had just finished painting. Segawa was found with all sorts of computer brands, be it Toshiba, Dell, Sony, and to mention but a few. And these are said to be most of the brands that are common here in Uganda on the market. Segawa claims he imports all the labels from China, but also makes some locally. We also want to know whether there are some shops that have been uh, cooperating with as far as creating market for these computers is concerned because uh, uh, all signs show that the business is big and it has been involving a reasonable amount of money. He was also found with different color paints and media allegations that some of the stolen laptops are rebranded and painted making it hard for anyone to identify before they are sold to unsuspecting buyers. Uh, the information uh, uh, they, they have given shows that uh, their market goes far beyond Uganda. It is alleged that serial numbers are also changed here. According to a source privy to the investigations, up to 140 cases of stolen laptops have been reported in areas around Makere University in one month alone. Studio Gerhanga, NTV.